हेलो स्टूडेंट्स आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग वेल सो टुडे वी विल स्टार्ट चैप्टर नंबर सिक्स मैरिज डॉग इज ब्राउन सो लेट स्टार्ट इन दिस चैप्टर वी विल लर्न यूज ऑफ एपेस्ट्रॉफी एंड एस अ स्पेशल साइन टू टॉक अबाउट दीज थिंग्स इट इज कॉल्ड एन एपेस्ट्रॉफी एंड एस दिस वन नाउ we are having some rules a noun can show what it owns or possesses we add an apostrophe s to a noun to show ownership a noun that shows ownership or relationship in a possessive noun for example mary has a dog Mary's dog is brown. Here, Mary is a singular noun, and the apostrophe s shows that the dog is belong to Mary, which is brown in color. Okay, now a possessive noun always comes before the noun that belongs to it. Now we will see second example. The lorry has wheels. The lorry's wheels are huge. So here, lorry is a singular noun, and the apostrophe s shows the wheels are belong to lorry, and wheels are huge. We add. and apostrophe s to make a single singular noun possessive now we will move on second rule so we add an apostrophe s to a plural noun that does not end in s that does not end in s to make it possessive we can use apostrophe plus s if plural nouns does not end in s why i am saying this because not all plural nouns ends in s for example the children have lunch the children's lunch is pizza children is a plural noun so here we will put apostrophe then s in second example the men have carrots the men's carrots are big here men is a plural noun and here first we put apostrophe then s now according to our next rule we add only an apostrophe to make a plural noun ending in s apostrophe possessive we cannot use apostrophe plus s if a plural noun ends with s according to this rule in first example we can see the snails shells are pink here snail is a plural noun and we will put apostrophe after s but we cannot use another s after this now we can see in second example the girls pets are kittens here girls is a plural noun and we will put apostrophe after s but we cannot use another s after this 